Hi, my name's Ultra, and I want to tell you about the Transformers. Today, I'd like to tell you about the Transformers Armada episode, Soldier. In this episode, the Autobots are once again continuing their search for more Minicons as they try and keep them away from the evil Decepticons. But this time, they're in the Arctic. We begin with Hotshot playing with the kids and the Minicons. I don't like this game tag. Red Alert scolds him for not doing his chores. Hotshot, knock it off. We've got plenty of work to do around here. Hey, can't a bot have a little fun around here? Not when I'm stuck doing all your work for the last two hours. And Optimus tries to explain the importance of doing your homework. Red Alert and I have fought many battles together, Hotshot. And long before you were reassigned, we won those battles because he had done his homework. It's not glamorous, but it's essential. So, the Autobots and Decepticons both detect another Minicon signal and go to collect it. Oh man, it's freezing! Don't worry, Carlos. As long as we're wearing these suits, we'll be fine. Eh, I still wouldn't wear one of these jumpsuits. Couldn't I get one in red, or white, or pink, or just about any color other than orange? If not, I think I'd rather go without it. The cold never bothered me anyway. The cold never bothered me anyway. It's kind of funny how after the Decepticons warp in, the iceberg they're standing on shifts slightly under their weight. It would have been really funny if the iceberg tipped over and dumped them into the ocean. But I guess they didn't want to go that comical. Meanwhile, Optimus demonstrates why you should buy his leader class toy. Or, as it was known back then, his super base toy. Wait a minute, Super Base? I guess Nicki Minaj is a big Transformers fan. They call me Megatron. Shorty's a Megacon. It ain't about the race either, it's the marathon. After Red Alert fixes Optimus's drivetrain, Hotshot is raring to get going again. Unfortunately, it seems that he forgot his snow tires. Ah, nuts! I knew I should have brought along snow tires. See, I told you, Hotshot. Luckily, his little buddy Jolt is able to give him a boost. Oh, and hey, Hotshot, you mind cranking up the heat in here a touch? It's cold. Wait, I thought they were protected from the cold by their ugly jumpsuits. I guess they're not as effective insulators as they thought. Meanwhile, Starscream spots the Minicon plate, but he also spies Hotshot closing in. Look behind you! Oh, holy smokes, Hot Rod, we're surrounded! Wait, Hot Rod again? His name is Hotshot. I mean, he's not even red with flame decals like Hot Rod is. Well, at least he isn't yet. But Hot Rod was Hotshot's name in Japan. So maybe that's where they're getting confused? So Hotshot charges Starscream, knocking him on his butt. You disappoint me again, Starscream. You're pathetic. <laughs> Make it turn out. Enough of your petty excuses! Ah, some things never change. Namely, Megatron and Starscream's whole dynamic. You disgust me! You are either lying, or you're stupid! I'm stupid! I'm stupid! You're an idiot, Starscream! Who's that Minicon? Transformers Armada, with power-linking Minicon warriors that unlock new attacks and weapons. Laser Beak reporting to Decepticon in range! You convert Hotshot, then power link with Jolt to fire missiles. Now let them have it! Demolish your blackout! Counterattack! The Minicon battle continues in a Transformers fight to the finish. New Transformers Armada. Each sold separately, actual change time will vary. It's Long Arm! Long Arm! By the way, throughout this episode, Demolishor seems to have a purple Autobot symbol on his chest instead of a Decepticon one. Maybe he's actually Shattered Glass Demolishor? So, in order to fight the Decepticons, Hotshot ditches Carlos and leaves him on the side of the crevasse. Which kinda reminds me of an episode of Rescue Bots Academy. Speaking of which, 
Too bad the Autobots in this show can't transform with the humans still inside them like the original Rescue Bots can. You two find a place to hide. Alexis, you wait here, understand? I'm going after Carlos. No, I'm coming with you, Red. Did you two not hear Red Alert? He told you to go and hide. These kids never listen. Well, Red Alert comes to Hot Shot's rescue, but when Megatron takes him hostage, Red Alert is forced to pull out his secret weapon. And how about showing me what you got? Hey, you can't flash your chest like that, Red Alert. This is a kid's show. Cover up those puppies. When Optimus comes to save Red Alert and Hot Shot, we can see that Megatron's Decepticon symbols have also turned into purple Autobot ones. Man, they really cannot keep these factions straight, can they? The Decepticons retreat. For some reason. I mean, it's still three on three, but I guess they prefer to have an unfair advantage. Meanwhile, Starscream has climbed down to retrieve the Minicon. But Rad and Alexis have also come to save Carlos. And all of Starscream's punching knocks them off the edge. Luckily, they are saved by one of Red Alert's Energon pizzas that shoots out of his chest. Starscream grabs the Minicon plate, but Red Alert snatches it with his little flying drone. I didn't even know that he had one of those. Back at the base, we get a preview of the new Minicon, but it doesn't fully awaken yet. And this episode ends with Hotshot apologizing to Red Alert. I guess I owe you an apology, Red Alert. You don't owe me anything. We're on the same team, remember? I know I said some pretty harsh things before, and I'm really sorry. Okay? <laughs> well, this was another okay episode of Transformers Armada. I like that we finally got some character development between Hotshot and Red Alert. That was pretty cute. It's also interesting how we got our first member of the Weapon Minicon Combiners which will play a much greater role later in the series. But it is weird how they didn't comment in this episode how the Minicon didn't awaken. It seems out of the norm for what we know about Minicons at this point. I guess they're saving that for a future episode. Well, let me know what you thought of this episode of Transformers Armada. Remember to like, subscribe, and do all that other fun stuff. And I'll see you back here next time for episode 6, Jungle. See you then!